get from the Helsinki airport all the way to the city center, all you have to take is one train, the P train, and it goes directly into the city center in 28 minutes. You can use a transportation card for every mode of transportation, ferry, trams, railroads, and you can have an unlimited for each day, up to seven days. In Helsinki, the main mode of transportation is the tram, and it's so easy to use. There's so many lines. You can get basically anywhere in the city using the tram. This church is built directly into the bedrock. Even when it rains, water trickles down its walls. It's one of a kind that you won't see anywhere else in the world. This is the premier place to see Finnish artwork with over 5,000 pieces inside the museum alone, including Alvarato's exhibit. He is the world-renowned architect and designer of many chairs and furniture you might even recognize in your own home. This is the oldest part of Helsinki, with a statue dedicated to Alexander II who was loved in Finland but hated in Russia, and all the surrounding architecture made by Carl Engel. Okay, Helsinki is a lot of fun, but sometimes you just need a little bit of silence. So come into the Chapel of Silence and enjoy the beautiful architecture, but be quiet. If you had to go to only one store in Helsinki, you have to go to Marimekko. Finnish design is a little bit different from Scandinavian design in the sense that it's still minimalistic, but they have pops of color. Here is the market square. There's food and there's souvenirs. Let's take a look. Finland is known for their amazing berries and here you can find among the freshest berries of all sorts and kinds. Even berries you probably never heard of about before. Let's try it out. Mm. Highly recommend coming here, buying yourself many berries, have a good snack as you visit Helsinki. If you're looking for a very hearty meal on the go, then grab yourself some salmon with a bunch of buttery potatoes. Welcome to the Market Hall. It dates back all the way to the 1800s. And here you can find an assortment of different foods, cheeses, prepared meats, everything. Now, one of the things I love most about Helsinki is that you can get unlimited refills of coffee at most coffee shops. And that's because the Finns are the number one coffee consumers in the entire world. Almost twice as more coffee is consumed here in Finland than in the United States. Here, I'm in heaven. Cheers. Welcome to Saga in Helsinki. It is a little bit of Lapland all the way down here in the capital of Finland. Lapland is the very far north of Finland, right above the Arctic Circle. It's a very popular destination during the winter time. As you can probably tell, everyone wants to see the snow, hang out with the reindeer, go skiing. But here today, we're having the food from Lapland. I'm having a very unique cocktail called the Lapish Wilderness. I don't even know what half of those ingredients are, but this tastes like pure Christmas in the glass. Mm. So food from the very up north tends to get a very bad rap, but trying this sour bread, the fish pike, I'm really blown away by Lapish food. I think this might be very underrated, especially I barely see Lapish food places here in Helsinki. Um, the reason this oak restaurant is open is because a couple from the Lapland moved down here and wanted to bring a piece of the Lapland to Helsinki. And I'm so happy that it did so because this food is hearty and flavorful. This is the traditional Finnish flatbread made with potatoes and so soft and chewy. It's perfect for any starter of the meal. And they usually serve it with egg butter, which is butter just mixed with eggs. And this is delicious. I'm obsessed with this bread. If you come here to Helsinki, definitely grab yourself this type of bread. 
these guys make a modern spin off traditional Finnish cuisine, including this pike perch, which is a freshwater fish on top of a potato pancake. If you want to have the hippest dining experience in all of Helsinki, then definitely come to Holiday Bar. Grab yourself a matcha cocktail, the appetizer, which is cauliflower on strawberry hummus and a beautiful grilled octopus. And that was only the cusp of what is offered in Helsinki. Thank you so much everyone for watching this video guide. If you have any other questions about Helsinki or had any favorite experiences in this beautiful city all the way in the north, leave it in the comments below. I'm Ariel with Urbanist. Keep being awesome and always keep on exploring.